Welcome back, folks. As I promised last video, if you watched that, which you should, I'm gonna crush some people under, the, under this container. Yeah, well, people. All marks. Hi, guys. Fun. I, I, should, I really should stop playing right now. I've been recording several videos in a go again. I figured there's no use in staggered updates, since at the time of recording this, I have like two faithful viewers. So. So there's sort of no point in keeping, keeping them waiting. If they want to watch the entire game in one go, so be it. If we get future subscribers, it's not going to matter, you know, how quickly I release the old videos, because this LP is going to be done by that point. But I'm hungry. I should eat, I should eat dinner. And I started recording a while ago, so... Editing this is going to be a pain. But I can't stop now, I want to keep playing. This game is so... Fun. It, the story really picks up once you get... Well, once this happens. What with the wall works and the... Everything and the other stuff. That's also why my commentary's been lacking a little bit. During the last videos. Because I'm, I'm just... It's been so long since I played this that I just... yeah. <laughs> I don't really have anything to explain, it's just... oh, I'm just... I really want to focus on getting things done and... Wow, what the hell is that thing? I've never seen that before. Yeah, I just, I'm just basically playing like normal now. Instead of being in the mindset of doing an LP. So, like, yeah, I forget to speak. Um. Well, we're trudging through the Walvark facility. And we're being shot at by a turret. That's what's going on, in case you're wondering. We are Steve, we have four legs, we have an upgraded... Well, not upgraded, but we have a cool armor. Look at this. Well, not that cool, but... It's, 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 it is an armor, it's not just a poncho. But the poncho was cool too, I'm gonna miss that. The poncho was really neat. You can blow up this turret. These things have a crap load of health. The thud slugs keep bouncing off. I wonder if they work at all. Yes, they do. Good. Um... I wonder if we can lure those guys over to that explosive... ...barrel. I'm not sure. Oh, they're down there. Hey, you saw me, you bastard! Well, okay. I guess. Oh, is this where I'm supposed to go, or what? Ah, uh, looks like it. Oh boy, we're indoors now. I mean, really, truly indoor for the first time in the game, I think. We've been in houses, we've been in tunnels, but... This is something entirely different. Oh, I just missed something funny. He said something funny, but I couldn't hear it. Whoa! Does, um... Does this environmental style remind you of... Another game, perhaps? Say... Something that happens to take place in the same world as this? Is it starting to feel a bit more odd world now? Why is this closed? Am I not supposed to go there? I guess I'm supposed to go here. Man, I don't want to stop playing. I need to eat dinner. It's like... It's... it's uh... It's 9.30pm and I haven't eaten dinner and I'm hungry. But I just want to keep playing. Yeah. Every new video I record... It's like... Half an hour's more work to edit later to edit and convert and export and all that. And the worse my commentary gets because I'm just so happy to be playing this again. <laughs> Do you know how tricky it can be to hold something like this back? I mean, uh, it's just, it's crazy that we're like halfway through the game. Well, maybe more than halfway, I'm not sure entirely. It, it's, hard, it's so hard to say because, I mean, 
time-wise, we're probably we're probably like two thirds through the game or something. But looking at like enemies defeated and how much environment we traversed, we're not even halfway through the game, I think. Because these places get huge. There's no, it's gonna, not going to be much more backtracking. We're just going to keep going up river bit by bit until we get to the dam. Wow, we need to get to the boat first, of course. Oh yeah, how, how how gutsy is it of them, of the developers, to keep something like this secret from the player throughout half the friggin' game? You spend half the game playing as something you think you know what it is, but then it turns out, nope, your character is something else. He's been hiding this even from you, even from you, the player. And how tricky must it have been to 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 review this game when it came out? Because I've read some reviews in this game, and they don't mention this whole Steve thing. Why would they? That ruined... That would completely ruin that story. It's like, uh, when Halo came out. When the Xbox was new, before I got mine, I probably read like 20 different reviews of Halo, the first one. Not one of them mentioned the Flood. If you haven't played Halo, that's, uh... If you haven't played Halo, why are you watching me play this? But <laughs> yeah, that's an enemy type that gets introduced. Like... Uh, two thirds through the game or so, like the last three levels. And yeah, they they kept it a secret. None of the PR for the game, none of the reviews for the game mentioned the flood to keep it a to keep it a shock when they find out here. Yeah, they must have done the same thing with this. And like, what? How fun would it be to write a review of a game that you? Really now? Wow. What? What the hell? How rude am I? Oh yeah, how fun would it be to write a review if you're a professional reviewer? Write a review of a game that you're not allowed to talk about like half of everything that happens. You can't mention the story, which is my favorite thing of this game. I mean, it's a brilliant game on all sides. But the thing that really steals the deal is the brilliant storyline. The way, the way it's all set up, in my opinion. I mean, it's fun to play, the graphics are amazing, the soundtrack's good, the sound effects are a bit... Uh, actually. But it's a solid game throughout, but still the story is really... You might walk into this game liking it for another reason, but when you're done playing it, you will love it for the story. You will love it for... I mean, not the, it's not like <laughs> it's not the most complex storyline or anything, but it's the way they do this with a stranger being who he is and revealing the way they re reveal why he is the way he is and things like that. It's just brilliant. And yeah, back to the point. Ah, oh, damn it! Those slog poachers are sending slags out at me. I don't know where a slog poacher would keep slags in his bag, but I think that's what they're called and what they do. Okay, less talking, more playing, huh? This is Let's Play, after all, not a Let's Talk about Stranger's Wrath. Why haven't I taken that guy out yet? He's the- oh, crap, what? No! Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> Don't stop and smack the dogs around, that's not gonna help much. <sighs> come on! <laughs> that boom bat wants to blow something up. I'm gonna let him. There, are you happy now? There's the poacher. There we go. Ow, stop that. Ow! What? You're not a dog. Or slag. Or slog. Or slug. Or anything that starts with S for that matter. Okay. <laughs> Wow, I lost focus there for quite a bit. Not sure what I was doing, I was praising the game, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, my, my point, like I started talking about five minutes ago. How fun would it be to write a review about a game that when you can only talk about what happens in half the game, and the best part of the game, you're not allowed to talk about it all. How do you write a review like that? Tricky business. 
I'm sure. I wouldn't know. I'm not a reviewer. And look at this place. How much more of a contrast can you get from going to from the the, uh, the desert to the pine tree wilderness to this? And for that matter, <laughs> from being a mysterious bounty hunter to I don't know the mythological guardian of the natives. I don't even know. What I'm gonna what I'm gonna call the Steve. That's pretty much what he is. The ancient garden. Oh, hey, look at that. We're out of time. I have to stop playing here because I'm gonna go eat. So I hope I don't keep you waiting too long until next video. Of course, most people will. Never mind. I don't have time to talk. Take care. See ya.